Hi there. In this video, I'm just going to show you uh, quickly how to use the ring buffer tool, um, which is where you've got a feature selected, an object selector selected. In this case, it's a point. I know it's a sort of uh, knife and fork. That's because it's far, fast food data from um, the uh, OpenStreetMap uh, uh, data set, uh, actually from Austria. And that's the Orbis raster, uh, raster uh, uh, mapping underneath it. Uh, so I've selected this one point. What I'd like to do is, is very quickly draw a sort of one kilometer, five kilometer and a 10 kilometer ring around that point. It's a ring, obviously, because it's a, a buffered point. So I wanted to sort of do three in one go. If you look at the buffer command, you'll see that, uh, you know, you can create, you can buffer old table, etc. There's a few options there. Um, but if you go to home and click on tool extensions, on registered, you'll see ring buffer. So if you check that to auto load it, I'll just double click and, and effectively get it running. And now when I go to the buffer command again, you'll see concentric buffers added to the bottom of the list. So it's a new buffer sort of type. So I click on that and it says, well, how many, you know, how many buffers do you want here? Well, in kilometers, I'll have a one kilometer, a five kilometer and 10 kilometer. Uh, you can clear it, you can specify exactly where you want to store it, uh, smoothness, etc. Usual buffer commands plus setting the style, which by default I have this sort of red um, polygon that's not filled. And you can um, calculate statistics as well if there's any data um, to be calculated, but there isn't in, in this case, you know, to sum and average and stuff. Press OK. Um, I've done it before. So um, it says, do you want to overwrite what you did before? Yep. And there you go. So now I've got these concentric uh, buffers. And when you click on it, they're actually rings. They're like sort of donuts. And that's the point here. Um, you've actually got this area defined um, uh, within those distances. So this outer ring. Um, so that, that, that well, I think I did one kilometer there. And in fact, I can double check that. I did one, five, and 10. Okay, so um, so that's the one there. And then this is the five one. So that's sort of greater than one and, and less than or equal to five. And then that's five to 10. So you've got this very clear five to 10 sort of corridor, this ring, uh, this donut shape, which um, would be a further interest for uh, additional analysis. Anyway, that's a quick look. That's concentric uh, ring buffers. It only appears at the bottom there when you've got the tool loaded. Um, and you'll see ring buffer there loaded. I hope you find that useful. Thank you.